Welcome to First Steps to Al-Anon Recovery from Al-Anon Family Groups. This is a series of podcasts to discuss some common concerns for people who have been affected by someone else's drinking. Al-Anon's primary purpose is to help families and friends of people who have a drinking problem. Today we're going to ask Al-Anon members what they expected to find at their first Al-Anon meeting. And what did you expect to find at your first Al-Anon meeting? What I expected to find at my first Al-Anon meeting was the meeting. I had been to counseling where I thought it was safe between my counselor and I. She suggested Al-Anon to me. She thought she was exhausting herself about what she knew about the impact of alcoholism on me and thought I would best benefit from going to an Al-Anon meeting. And she found a meeting for me not too far from me, and I agreed. I promised her I'd go. But it had changed locations. So when I found the location, I was very warmly greeted, and people were at different levels of their own comfort in applying the steps and slogans and the traditions to their own lives. I stayed because I wanted to listen to what people had to say. And what I heard was just a little bit of hope. And I also heard humor. And and to me, when I hear a little bit of humor, I know everything's going to be okay. Thanks for letting me share. Great. Thanks for sharing your experience with us, Anne. Linda, what did you expect when you went to an Al-Anon meeting for the very first time? Well, I found Al-Anon through a coworker, and she explained to me the basic setting that there would be other people in the room at the same time and that they would be studying something called the 12 Steps. Shortly after I went to my first meeting, I was invited to go to an open speakers meeting, which included a social afterwards. And I I was really relieved to find a place where I could go and have some fun and not have to worry about what the alcoholic was going to be thinking about what I was doing, because by this time, I was not in the relationship anymore. So I was very grateful that when I went to my first regular Al-Anon meeting, that there was no expectations of me. People took turns talking. They listened to what I had to say without judgment. And there was free coffee. I didn't have to pay for anything. There was no dues or fees. And it was a safe place to be. I didn't feel like I had to talk if I didn't want to. And I really appreciated that everybody was accepting of me. That's all I have at this time. Very good. Thanks, Linda. Betty, can you relate to what the other members said about going to an Al-Anon meeting for the first time, or were your expectations a little bit different? I can relate, and also my expectations were a little bit different. I went to my first meeting because the social worker and my husband told me that it would be really helpful, and I thought to myself, I don't need the help, but maybe if I go to these meetings, they can tell me what to do so I can raise my kids so they won't be alcoholic. So that was my expectation. When I got there, I found a group of people that were just about like me who were sharing things that I would never have dreamed of talking about. And my one feeling was a feeling of great relief. I am not the only person in this world that feels this way, who has experienced these things. I was absolutely thrilled to know that. It was such a great feeling. And so I kept coming back because I loved the way that those meetings made me feel. And thank you for letting me share. Well, thanks for sharing your experiences with us, Betty. And thank you, everyone, for listening to this discussion about what to expect at your first Al-Anon meeting. You're invited to join this discussion by leaving a personal comment at alanon.org. Just click on the First Steps to Al-Anon Recovery icon. Under the topic, click on Comment, then scroll to the bottom and add your comment. You're welcome to join us for any of the First Steps to Al-Anon Recovery podcasts from Al-Anon Family Groups. You're also welcome to join us for a face-to-face meeting of Al-Anon family groups in your own community. Just click on how to locate an Al-Anon meeting, or you may call toll-free 1-888-4-ALANON to find an Al-Anon meeting near you. Thank you for listening to First Steps to Al-Anon Recovery from Al-Anon Family Groups.